Hey Care Bears, it's Haley here. Welcome back to another Raw High video on my channel. If you're new here, make sure to subscribe for daily Raw High videos. Anyways, in today's video, I want to show you guys how to complete the maze in under like five, three minutes. Honestly, it could maybe even take two minutes if you really learn how to do it. Now, obviously, it might take a little bit longer, um, but overall once you get to knowing like the path it takes around like maybe like two minutes just to finish the maze so anyways let's go ahead and get started so the only way as of right now that a lot of people only know of to finish the maze requires have like having the fly fast game pass unfortunately as soon as i find out a way to do it without this i will make a video because i know not everyone has it and it's honestly not even fair that uh, you need the fly fast game pass to beat it. So trust me, if you don't have the fly fast game pass, as soon as I find out a different way to do this, I will make a video. But as of right now, this is the only way. So the first thing you need to do is put it up to a thousand percent. And then you need to like turn on autumn evening as well, um, just so you can see better. And then you need to kind of like fly upwards before i even start i just want to show like where we're supposed to be flying to um so when you have autumn evening on you can see it a lot better but there's this black hole like right here and if i move my camera up you can actually like see that you can go through it so that's basically where we're flying up and you have to do it really fast because your fly powers like get taken from you so anyways let's start right here and and go oh i messed up that time <laughs> oh i'm still flying oh Oh, I did it. Okay. So now that I have made it up here, we have two pathways to go on on this wall here. So these are the two pathways. There's left and right and you need to go right. Okay. So once you're at this purple candle, go ahead, just keep walking straight. And then you need to go through this little black like picture, like PNG thing and drop all the way down to here. And then there's a chest here. I haven't opened it yet. Um, I'm going to open it later, but then after this, uh, there's like this little point here. So it's a reference, just turn right towards it this way. And then here is the next candle that is kind of like a guide point for you. Okay, so after this candle, go this way, up here, then turn right this way, and then turn left this way, and then drop down, and then turn left once you drop down, and then around here, and go to this purple candle here. Okay, so after it gets to the purple candle, you need to start jumping up these walls here with these candles, like guiding you, and then where do you go? Oh yeah. And then you need to jump behind like that. Oh my gosh, I got scared. I thought I wasn't going to make it. Okay, so you need to go right from there. And then keep going through. And then at this purple candle, go right again. And then you need to drop in this hole right here. Then turn around and go down this way. So once you're here, you just walk straight down into this hole right here. And then... This pumpkin's like a reference. You turn around and then you go this way and keep walking along here. There's another pumpkin here and then keep going this way and then and then we need to go right this way and then go up this way here and then once we get to this point turn left this way and then go down and then go left where you see the pumpkin light strings. Keep walking. There's another candle. And then just keep walking. There's nowhere to turn yet. And then keep going. Here's a pumpkin. And then we need to go right. Then up this way and through here. And this is the end of the maze. And I haven't gotten the chest yet. Thank you, Nathan, for helping me. Nathan's been secretly telling me the, um... The way. The way. But, hey, look! 2,000 candy and the steampunk wings. So, it's the same item as last year. But, hey, you get 2,000 candy. So, if you want some candy, that is a great way to get candy. And, yeah, so, that is how you beat the maze. It is kind of difficult considering you have to get the fly speed, like, game pass. But I'm sure there's an easier way without, like, the game pass. But for now, that's the only way that people really know. 
So I'll let you guys know if um, there's a new way to get the like the chest at the end of the maze and beat the maze. But for now, that is the way. So anyways, I'm going to go through here. And anyways, stay tuned for a full chest locations video as well soon. I'm going to be working on that very soon. So in the next day or so, that will be out too. I am trying my best. I'm also like still not even home right now. So I hope this video helped you guys out. And anyways, that is all for me for today. I hope you guys enjoyed. And anyways, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye Care Bears!